relationship scarred by abuse. He's saying that occasionally he gets physical with you. Occasionally, yeah, like every day. Why did you get him arrested? I didn't want to hurt my baby dad like that. And marred by cheating. I actually caught him cheating a couple times. I was cheating on him because you beat me. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. I know, it's not making any sense. You're cheating on him to get even because he beat you? That's not a reason to cheat, that's a reason to get out. Today, on Judge Allen, will a surprise witness add fuel to this relationship fire? So she came over, started banging on the door. So I didn't answer the door, so she kicked it in. The deadbolt and everything and learned that my current girlfriend, you, you not like his new girlfriend? No. So look for your wrist. She's a f Hold on, hold on, hold on. As a cop, he stood up for the law. As a trial lawyer, he fought for the truth. And as a criminal court judge, he commanded authority. Now, he returns to preside over America's courtroom. Judge Allen. Jessica Bridges, he sued her ex, Albert Wilhelm, for allegedly not paying her for charges he made on her credit card and using her child tax credit. She's suing for $5,000. Albert Wilhelm says he has more than paid Jessica back by paying off her car and the car she wrecked. So he owes her nothing. All rise. Court of Charles Session, the Honorable Judge Alex Perez, who rise. Please be seated. Ms. Pritchett, you're suing your ex for money that he charged up on your credit card and also for refund he received on his taxes by claiming your child as a deductible. Is that right? Yes. Okay. And uh, Mr. Wilhite, you say that you paid off all those credit cards and in fact your child lived with you, so you were the one who had the right to pay the tax deduction. Basically, yes. Okay. All right. What happened? You started dating? Okay, we started dating. And I ended up being pregnant about a year and a half, two years down the road. Oh, on birth control. She told you on birth control? She was on birth control? Yeah, she told me she was on birth control. Were you on birth control? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not all the time. Okay, well apparently at this particular time you were not on birth control. She knew I wasn't on birth control. He knew to wear condoms. You told me you're That's birth control. control. You just told him. Yeah. Okay. So she missed a couple of days. Are we happy that we have this child? And now that he's here. Yeah. Right? yeah. Okay, yeah. good. Well, at least it's something good out of that. Right. So you got pregnant. Yeah. How was the relationship when you were pregnant? If there were problems. How was it? Um, or were you too busy packing the U-Haul, then packing the U-Haul to make yeah, the Yeah, that's, that's about right. It was pretty good. Um, we argued, but, you know, she was really my first serious relationship. We got together. She was 14, and I was 15. And um, wow. we stayed together for six years. So, um, so she was your first girlfriend? Yeah, basically. So, you know, I thought it was normal. Okay, we argued a lot. We fought a lot. But, um, yeah, yeah, I thought it was normal. That's pretty much it. Yeah, right? Yeah, so, but, you know, boyfriends nowadays, they don't beat their wives. Oh, or girlfriends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's saying that occasionally he gets physical with you. And eventually you end up hitting him. Okay, so like every day. Every day. Why would you say there was enough of that? I don't know. I didn't. Well, I had a kid. I didn't know any better. Why didn't you get him arrested? I did. I finally did. But I didn't want to hurt my baby's dad like that. On the on the job, a relationship beyond repair. Did you get along now? No, we hate each other. Yeah, I don't talk to him. And later, his new girl pays a surprise visit. They were broken up. Because she stole him from me. I'm talking. I'm talking. Quiet. Oh, I have to send Victor out for a giant saucer of milk here. Well, 